hi welcome back to my channel if you are new then welcome my name is Sophie Payne and I do all things plus size and today we are doing a Shein haul I've done I think two Shein hauls before on my channel so I'll link those down below both of those were items that I purchased myself this um haul is going to be items that I've been gifted by Shein so all opinions will be my own and all of that good jazz and I'm just going to get straight into it um, and get through everything so if you want to see what I got from Shein then stay tuned Right, if I sound a little bit croaky, it's because I've got a cold, but we're running with it anyway. So, first up, I'm going to run through a few, a few things that you might have questions on. So, um, my Sheen parcel has taken just over a week to arrive, and that's pretty standard. Um, obviously, it's slightly different because I've been gifted, so it's actually the team that ran the order for me. However, like I say, I've purchased from there twice before, and both times they've come between one and two weeks depending on which shipping you choose it all came packed in this box here um i know that can be a concern when things are coming from another country how it's going to be packaged um it is sort of squeezed in but not not sort of anything horrendous um so it came in this box here and then every item comes in little individual plastic bags that are sort of like ziplock bags and then you just pop them back in these little bags if you want to return any items i've also done two returns through sheen and they both went through absolutely fine the money it used to drop into like a wallet and you'd have to log back in and claim the money through the wallet but you don't have to do that now it's um all automated returns so read the returns policy if you think that that might be an option but i've done it twice and it's been absolutely fine and i think that's everything to say so i'm going to get straight into the haul and start showing you some clothes okay first off i picked up this little boob tube um because I've got a little bit of an obsession with Mustangs, like I absolutely love them. If I could have any car in the world, it would be a Mustang. Um, and I saw this little boo tube and I was like, that would look so cute um, in summer with either just like these kind of jeans or some big black pleasy trousers I thought would look cute. So I picked this up and it's literally just a stretch boob tube, no sleeves. Um, and it's just got Mustang printed on and it... It's good quality, it's kind of shiny, super stretchy. So I think it's gonna fit over my very little boobs. Um, so yeah, picked that up and it was literally like a few quid. I'll link everything down below, I'll link the prices down below and I think I might have a discount code so I'll link that down below as well. So yeah, that's the first item, Mustang boob tube. Okay, so bear in mind I need to wear like no bar no bar no bra or a strapless bra and um, this is the mustang t-shirt i really really love it this 100 percent with jeans would be like a summer vibe for me and um, i love the print of it i just think it's really cool there's not a lot to say about the fit because it's just sort of a very standard boob tube but it's nice and stretchy so if your boobs is a little bit bigger you get away with it um, and it comes down to sort of the waist which is where my jeans start so i'm really happy with that i think that's so cute the second thing i've picked up and off the bat i'm like this is my favorite item is this t-shirt here and um, we all know i love a t-shirt and these kind of like burnt oranges as you can tell are my favorite color at the moment um so i picked this t-shirt up and then on the front it's just got like a couple of cars it says cruising um and i've had a few of their t-shirts before and they do wash well because i know that can be a concern so they do actually wash really well um, i've never had any issues with the prints coming off so hopefully this one's the same and they have this in a few different colors but i just really like this kind of burnt orange so we all know that I'm going to be wearing that very, very soon. 
as in as soon as I turn the camera off, this is going on. Oh my god, this is my absolute fave thing ever. Um, pulled out again t-shirt. This one is quite generous. I would say this is quite like a true to size 26 probably. Um, if I took it under, which again is how I would wear it. I love this. I really, really like this. Um, it's got that sort of like retro, sort of like journey feel to it. Um, but obviously like a cheaper option. So yeah, I think it looks a little bit vintagey. I think the colour makes it look really cool. But if it's not your cup of tea, I think they do it in, I think it's black and white actually. Um, so yeah, massive fan of this one. Massive fan. The next thing I picked up is a shirt and this is the shirt here um off the bat like out of the package I don't know if it's gonna fit um but we'll see so it's not the greatest quality it's not like a thick um kind of shirt but the one side is this sort of denim but it's not it's not like um, proper denim, like jeans denim. It's like that thin cotton. I think it's called sham, chambray, chambray. I don't know. And then the other side is just this check. So yeah, no shirt. Not doesn't feel like it's the best quality. It's a little bit sort of stiff, a little bit thin. Um, and I don't know how the sizing's gonna be. But style wise, I really really like this. And this is the shirt. It actually surprisingly does up, which I didn't think that it would. Um, it's not like the greatest fit around the tummy. Like it is a little bit. A little bit tighter I could have done with that being just a little bit bigger um but actually it's it's not too bad like I would probably like roll it up and tuck it in or tie it maybe or even wear it open with a t-shirt underneath so actually I'm not mad at it I'm not mad at it I quite like it next I got a dress and the reason that I got a dress um is because i had loads of feedback on my boohoo um video saying that you wish that i tried some like dresses and trousers and things on um and i guess i just kind of go on these stores and order what i know i would wear and i know that that tends to be more t-shirts jumpers um so i thought i'd try a dress so i can tell you all what the sizing's like um this is absolutely beautiful it's very sort of like hippie 70s vibe which i absolutely love um and it's just all it's the same floral print but just in all different colors um again it's cotton it's not got any stretch in it so i don't know how it's gonna fit it's got a little stretch around the the waistband but the materials not stretchy and um, long sleeves i think if there's a problem anywhere it will be the arms because nothing fits my arms in um but yeah i think that's really really nice love the colors of it so i'm really hoping it fits because i think for like a festival this would be absolutely beautiful well jesus christ i am over the bloody moon with this um i'm really sorry about the lighting I really need to get a blind. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm really, really happy with this. Actually, it's quite nice. It's a little bit tight on the tummy, um, but nothing massive. The arms fit really well, which I didn't think they would. And I just think it looks really, really nice. The length is also perfect because it's meant to be midi. So it's sort of like maxi on me. And I think with just some little boots, this will look delicious. So I'm just, I'm so happy with that. Chuffed, absolutely bloody chuffed. Jumping back into my comfort zone, um, I picked up another t-shirt that I just thought was quite cute. This is a grey ribbed t-shirt. It's sort of a crop, not massively crop, but a little bit cropped, so just below the waist. And it's got like a little, you know, like the lettuce hems. So it's got a little lettuce hem around the cuff and also around the waist. And then it's just grey ribbed and it's just got a little cherub embroidered on it, which I thought, again, quite cute. Like the fact that it's long sleeve, but it's crop as well. So I also picked that one up. Right, this is the sort of cherub t-shirt. Again, pulled out. It sort of just sort of sits below my waist. Um, 
Did you see that? <laughs> Just conk my head off the sleeve. Off the shelf. Um, so again, probably where it tucked in. Um, it's a bit tighter on the body, but I think that's how it's meant to fit. Um, the sleeves are of good length because I've got really short arms, so I'm fine with the sleeves being a little bit longer. Um, but bear that in mind, if you are taller, the sleeves are quite a good length. And yeah, I think that's quite cute. Again, just to sort of chuck on. So, oh my God, we're doing well. Next, I picked up a shirt, which again, any, I feel like anything without stretch makes me a little bit nervous, um, but we'll see. So this is the shirt here. I picked this up because I am obsessed with the print. It's sort of white with this blue pattern on that everywhere seemed to have stuff in this last summer. There was a dressing next that we absolutely loved that we couldn't get hold of. Um, and that was this pattern. So I think that's what made me want to get it. But basically, it's like almost like a creamy nude on the background. And then on the front, it's got just like jungle prints with like elephants and birds and tigers and all sorts. It's so beautiful up close. Um, and like I said, this is just silky blows. This feels like beautiful quality. Um, I got it in a 4X. Again, don't know how it's going to fit on the body, to be honest, but we'll see. And then it's just got, like, baggy arms. So I'm really hoping that fits because I think it's the cutest thing. Okay, so this is the blowers. A um, couple of things. It actually fits better than I thought it was going to. So I can get it on and I can do the buttons up um, if it's tucked in. Um, I haven't done the sleeve buttons just because... I can't manoeuvre myself properly. Um, it's gaping a little bit here on the boob area, but I have got like a bra on, which I don't normally wear. <laughs> but I have got a bra on, so I think that I would probably, it's not, um, it's not that it doesn't fit around there, it's just sort of the placement of the buttons means that it pulls a little bit. So I think I'd probably put a little press stud there so i would wear it tucked in so i'm actually really happy with it however size wise like pulled out it doesn't you can see it like wrinkles up at the back because i can't get it over my hip so it's not exactly how i'd want it to fit um but i could wear it sort of tucked in so i would say that this probably i think this is a 4x i'll link all the sizes down below i would say this is probably more of a 22 24 so just bear that in mind check the size guides when you order but yeah i'm actually pleasantly surprised because i will definitely wear this next i got a sort of like t-shirt so this is a stretchy t-shirt on the top, so little v-neck, stretchy body, and then it's got these organza sleeves that are in a polka dot. Um, my only criticism on unopening this is that the sleeves don't look like they're very big, and I think these organza sleeves look beautiful when they're like really oversized. So I'm going to check out what the sleeves are like on the model. Um, because it might just be me but I really like this and I think that they look lovely for like a night out when you want to dress up but you don't um, so we'll see what this fits like but quality wise pretty good um, the organza sleeves are nice and then they've just got like flocked polka dots on them and then cuffs so let's see how that fits okay this is the organza t-shirt pulled out um, it's actually quite long, so it's sort of like bottom of the hip. Um, again, I would probably tuck it in and wear it sort of tucked a little bit. Um, this one surprised me because I didn't think I was going to love it, um, but I do. I do wish it was a little bit bigger on the arms, but it is comfortable. It's not sort of tight at all. I just wish that they had a bit more of a puff to them. Um, but for the price of this, like, it's an actual bargain. And I think you could wear this on a night out with, like, a leather skirt and really dress it up. So I'm really, really happy with that for the price. I think that's really cute. Then I picked up another T-shirt. This is the last T-shirt, I promise, um, which is this one here. And it says, save the bees, plant these. And it's just got all little cute um, flowers on. 
as you know, love a novelty t-shirt, pretty much all I live in, so I thought that one was quite cute. And honestly, Shein's t-shirts are such a good price, such a good price, like they're all less than a tenner. So pick that one up, I think it's cute. Let's see what it fits like. This is the Save the Trees plant these. Save the bees, not the trees. Save the trees, save the bees, plant these. Um, so yeah, this is it sort of pulled out. So I've pulled out, um, not baggy, but not tight, just sort of like a standard, I'd say like a standard 24 probably. Um, but you know what I'm gonna say, I would, tuck it in or fold it up or whatever. So I would wear it like this. I really, really, really like this. Um, it's definitely up my street, it's something that I'd wear all the time. So I'm really, really happy with that. Um, and yeah, it feels like really nice quality. It's nice and um, thick. You can't really, bear in mind it's a white t-shirt. I've got like a black bralette on. Um, you can't see through it at all. So I'm really happy with that. Then I picked up this cardigan, and this won't be everyone's cup of tea, but there was something about it I really liked. Um, so it's a long, well, long-ish, it's probably going to be to my knee, long-ish cardigan, um, really thick knit, so definitely will give you some warmth. Um, almost like I would say, like that cardigan jacket kind of vibe cardigan um and then the pattern is just like almost like a fair oil kind of vibe um but it's all like browns and greys and things like that so i picked that up and i don't know i just thought with a nice pair of jeans and just a little white tee and then throw that on i think it was quite cozy so yeah picked that up and i'm actually really impressed with the quality of this because it's definitely a lot thicker than i thought it was going to be so we'll see what that one's like. Excuse the fact that I'm standing in my bra. Um, but this is the cardigan. It literally comes dead to my knee. Um, it's not the best fit. Um, it's not like very generous around here. I'm not entirely sure what size I've, I've got, so I will let you know down below. Um, but I like it, it's cute, it's got pockets, really nice thickness. However, I just wish it was a little bit bigger here because it's sort of a little bit gappy there. So I could still wear it just like open, um, but I just wish it was that little, that little bit bigger. And then finally, if you know anything about me, you know that I love pyjamas. I absolutely love pyjamas. I would literally wear a different pair of pyjamas every night if I could. So I've never tried Shein pyjamas before and I thought that I would give them a go. So let's see what they're like. So the first pair, um, these all come as twos so you can't sort of um, change the size of the top and the size of the bottom, they come as a pack. Um, this is the first pair which is like a navy blue and then they've just got this sun and moon polka dot print which I think is really really cute so pick those up I think these are just like baggy I don't think they're like legging bottoms Um, feel like they're quite a good size seem to be stretchy might have to turn them off at the bottom but yeah pick those up and then the top to go with those is this one here um so again just baggy t-shirt and it's got the sun and moon print on again navy blue and that seems like it's going to be a nice fit too oh my god look at these pajamas um really nice material really nice fit actually and um, they're a little bit long on the leg but We'll let them off because most people are taller than me. Um, so I'm going to turn these up a little bit. But yeah, top fit's really nice. They're a really soft, smooth jersey. So these are really, really comfy too. New faith place for pyjamas. And then finally, I could not leave without putting these in my basket. Um, and these are some pizza pajamas. <laughs> um, so these are the bottoms. They're black with little pieces of pizza all over them. Um, pepperoni pizza, I might add. Um, and these bottoms look like they might be slightly tighter. I don't think they're leggings, but yeah. 
So got those. They're quite a thin material, but I mean, to be honest, I really don't mind when it's a pair of pajamas. Um, and then this is the top. So long sleeved crop, and it just says I love pizza. Well, I love pizza, pizza. Um, and yeah, love a pair of novelty pajamas. Can't go wrong. So that's my final item. Oh my god, how bloody cute are these pajamas? I love them. I kind of want to wear the t-shirt like as a t-shirt. Um, the top fits really well, sort of cropped to the waist. And then the bottoms again fit really well. I'd say these fit like a 24 wood. Um, yeah, oh my god, I absolutely love them. How cute. Chuff, bloody chuffed. <laughs> Okay, so that's it. That is my Sheen haul. I really hope that you enjoyed it. Um, I feel like I've got some really good pieces and then some like, it's been a little bit hit and miss. So there's a couple of things that don't fit, a couple of things that fit really well and I know I'll wear a lot. Um, so personally, I think Sheen's great for t-shirts, pyjamas, jumpers, that kind of thing, but I probably wouldn't use it as much for um, dresses, blouses, because I just don't think that they fit as well. So yeah, I really hope that you enjoyed it. Please let me know down below what your favourite item was, and yeah, I'll see you all very, very soon for another video. Nobody see, nobody else.